Good evening. What's up, y'all? It's Deidre with One Shot Game. You already know what time it is. Happy Thanksgiving. I hope you guys have a lovely and blessed day with your family, your friends, whoever that may be. Now, you already know what the motto is. You get one shot at life for the lifetime to learn all the games. So I'm here to let you guys know this video is going to be really entitled to my women out there nothing against males i don't discredit males at all but today is the day that i need my women to call back their power and know that they're in control and know that we are the creators of life meaning don't let no one treat you other than that don't let nobody treat you less than you hold the power as the force and creator of life for all mankind not one single person in this world would be born without a woman and a lot of times due to old traditions out there it is uh normal for the woman to just work and become a maid and you know take care of the in-house duties with no goals or dreams while the man goes out and holds all the power because he works which means that you have to be at his every beck and call which means you have to sometimes lower yourself and your desires and your dreams and your needs just to be at his beck and call and let him know that he's the power and he's in control. Now, at the end of the day, don't get me wrong, it is some women out there that are okay with, you know, being that position in life of being the one that takes care of all the in-home needs with no desires and no dreams and no goals, just a in-home mother while the man goes and has all the power and the money by working and taking care of their bills now it's 2023 it's a new day and age you can stay at home and take care of the kids and also pursue your dreams and goals and uh a man that is confident in who he is as a person will allow you to do that without discrediting you or making you feel like you're less than or you know as a woman and him being your husband and taking care of the bills you have to do uh, whatever sexual things he asks you to do. And what if you don't want kids? What if you don't want kids right at this moment? You want to pursue your dreams and goals. What I'm saying right now is do that. Go after that. It's a lot of things going on in the world for young girls and young children and teenagers that a lot of us as women are only looked at as a piece of property something that can be sold but what is between our legs something that can be brainwashed and controlled the younger that we are able to sell our bodies which is our temples which is what has the power to dominate and control a lot of forces in life and the main thing give life it gives life to another human soul so i'm here to tell you that do not settle have your own mind don't let no one control you. Don't let no one brainwashing you into believing that you're nothing other than a sex slave, a sexual object. So you use sex and your body as a form of control because that's all you feel that you are worth. Queen, you're the creator of life. If you want to go pursue your dreams and chase anything that you want to, go do it. The more a woman is in power of control and she has her own bag, she is able to go out there and dominate any force she wants to because a lot of men in life think the only way to control a woman is through money and finance. You can get a woman to do anything if you got some money. I'm here to tell you, chase your own goals and dreams. Go after what you want. You will become a leader and a top boss. The moment you go out there and conquer anything you want to conquer, get your own bag, get your own money. And a lot of men will look at you as with such intimidation because now they can't control you with the money and the bag. We're trying to get out of that way. It's 2023. There is no God. There is no religion. You can hate me if you want, but the power is inside of us. And a lot of people are centered on their old ways of teaching. And a lot of men believe that God is a man. And a lot of times they go into power with saying that and they control a lot of women like that. It's a lot of cults. It's a lot of women who believe that these men are telling them that they won't be nothing if they don't do um, whatever they tell them to do.
God is not in the power of someone else. God is the power inside of you. Do not let anyone brainwash you. Do not let anyone control you. You go out there and chase whatever it is you want to chase in life. Go out there and be the best person that you want to be. Some of us are not ready to be sold or act as sexual property to have kids. And at sometimes that stops us from pursuing our dreams. If now, now we have to work on focusing on taking care of these kids. I'm here to let you know you can handle both. But at the same time, if that's not something that you're ready for or ready to do, do not let them control you. Have your own mind in this, in this world. It's happening all over the world. Young girls, man, as young as babies are being sold away to then procreate another souls that can also be in power of control by someone else because usually the brainwashing stage and the grooming stages starts with one individual and then carries on down the line it is now time to be in power and be in control of yourself chase what you want to chase go after what you want to go after do not let anybody control your mind do not let anybody stop you from doing what it is you want to do we are not sexual objects we are not sexual material. We are women, creators of life, very smart, very intellectual, and know what we want in life. And even sometimes when we fall short and we don't, just give us a little time. Hold off. We'll get there. But it's 2023. I can't express enough how I see such things all over the world of young girls just being looked at as sexual objects <laughs> you are not a sexual object do not let a man control you by money and what he has and that can make you do whatever he desires of you have your own mind control what you want to control do what you want to do the power is in your hands this is Deidre with one shot game happy thanksgiving y'all